Hello, hello everyone, my name is Kitz and welcome to another Skyrim mod review. Today I will be taking a look at the player house mod called, called Legend of the Eagle's Nest. It is. It was made by a guy called Flahoshi, I hope I spelled that right, if not I'm sorry. And it's basically a lower Flandroid fortress located at the at the summit of a mountain between the White Run over there, as you can see, White Run over there, and Riverwood, which is over there, right over there. What I mainly like about this mod is that it just fits so well in Skyrim, you know, because mainly nowadays the house mod are just, you know, to show you the you know, colors of the house or something like that, you know, the luxury, all the candles, you know, the, the, the fence. Feels like it's it's been in Skyrim from the start, you know. It just feels feels like it fits well in the, in the whole game. And I really like it because you know it's only it's not just my like second game. And I really I really like it. I do enjoy it. So yeah, it's it's really small, relatively small, but I think it can cope for everything you need and doesn't have any blind spots. You, know. you can uh, you have to complete a small quest to gain access to this tower. And I'll be taking over the quest later in the review, and but you can buy a steward over here, and uh, also a soldier for guarding your tower. But I think this inside is still over there, so we'll see. Soon, soon, you know. Another good thing is that the, this this whole tower is fully meshed, which means that you can go here with companions, five heroes, and get the hard fire. So yeah, that's that's really really cool. It also, it has its own special porch and a special model for lamp. If you notice, it is the south tower, which I'm standing on top of, right here, right here. And uh, the porch is right down here, through the stairs, and you can see this porch. The magic of this porch is that you can use either tent or holes or vampire stone to, to enhance your smiting or again, alchemy abilities. You add emphasis of gold, you will enhance it by 60% seconds, and if you add one fire salt, then it is 4% or 60 seconds too. So, yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, so the whole mod, the, uh, the whole tower is made out of material cells and elements there. Training dummy over here is a special like barrels, but not serious. Uh, then we have a so called tower, I'm sorry, which is standing right here, and you can get the alchemy button up there. So the other one we have here is uh, the service place, it's right here. It has a few benches, it's never usually hanging down around here, and a few barrels over here. There's a stair rather than under the porch. have a, a northeast place that's right now this place here you can fire you can chop your firewood over here and you can barrel benches again if you wanna have a look out and see the great view right here. And then we have a yeah, what, what? Oh and there's also secret passage somewhere down there but I'm not going there yet. So let's take a look at views you know nice little view of this tower. Then from the south tower, usually the eagle fly over here because it's better to fly to fly to the mother. And nice, that is a nice little tower over because it's a garden tower, you know, garden tower. As you can. So yeah, I think that's about it for the exterior part. So now we can take a look at the interior. So yeah. So the first interior step we have over here is the stone tree, which is a mine which you can. You know, good uh, do the good old things that you do in a mine. You know, you can pick up your pickaxe and then just go here, mine for some stuff and things, stuff and things. So there we go. You can you know you can 
malachite to make uh, orc armor I think that's right malachite is for orc and this whole location restart so it's not safe for storing anything because you know when it restarts all of your items are just gone so never store anything in here we have a, a quick silver ore and also there was another room over there I'm going right inside uh -huh. and you can mine the gold ore and ebony so you basically have everything for you to make a, a daydream armor and also some other armors like barber, barber, golden good and you know for all the mining needs for all the mining needs and also iron ore that's right iron never never can be missed and this right here opens up the Skyrim in which you can have another nice view which I really liked I really like this view let it load you see you have a nice little view right here and then down the stairs you know just take a look take a look at your nice nice you know nice nice Skyrim Let's head over to the second area, so shall we? Another interior so we have over here is the is a stable in which you have all your livestock that you buy in the quest like chickens, the cows, the goats, goaty goats and also we have our we have our oh that's that's you. You alright? You look like you might be sick. That's our oh, steward. Thank and you can also give him some oh, equipment, you know. You. If you feel like mm -hmm. feel like giving some equipment so Let's take a look at the. It's just a simple, you know, you know, just stable. You can sleep over here, sleep over there. You have a few. You have one chest. Let's take a look what's in chest. Oh, nothing really interesting and. Yes. Nothing really, you know, just a stable. But I really like it. It's well done. And let's take a look at another cell. But first thing first, I'm gonna show you this, this secret passage. As soon as the game loads, that's right. So after you complete the whole quest, I will let let you know the later in the video. You can you have the in the old world you get the secret passage right over here. Also, I think I can click right on this bit, and there we go. So it just go it. And come, come on, not that that's a small problem. I look and that's the secret passage to the. The, the secret passage. <laughs> That's right, secret passage, secret passage. Oh, one more of the secret passage. Let's let's go to the eagle's nest. I think the main interior cell in which you'll find everything your heart desires. That's right, everything. Maybe some, maybe no horse, but everything else. You get, you, you get, some, you get everything else you need. Everything. So we are here in the eagle's nest and there is our guard I think, oh that's mannequin, <laughs> phew you scared me a little bit so let's take a look at, this is the main cell I think that's the player house and you can get some guns over here, there, there are nice nice little pictures of silver hammer, long swords, there are some coin purses, it's a, you know it's like study room I think that's something like that, then over here we have a like, something like a dining room you know so you can eat over here with your companions and have fun with them okay, over here, oh that's upstairs, not going there yet not yet and you know what, let me pull out the I, I see everything but just in case it gets a little bit dark I'm gonna pull out my candlelight candlelight that's upstairs so here you have some scrolls, you have some books, you have some good stuff, good stuff then over here you have a, you have a kitchen you have a kitchen, that's right, the kitchen, in which your, your wife can cook, you know. And here, we, that's, I think that's uh, your alcohol room. That's right, oh, what's over here? Barrel. Barrel. So let's head upstairs and see what's up here. Hmm, there's, uh, there's a chest. Another chest. This lo <laughs> this chest looks like a uh, chest from the Shadow of Jotunheim mod, but... <sighs> You know that that mud. So let's take a look at the other side. And on the other side, you have a you have a bed for you and your wife. You know, the, the some nice you know some nice nice tables, nice things and tables. 
And I guess that's that's this uh, this bunk. So let's take a look at the last. So yeah, now we're here. Down here, and you have the Indian rank over here. I can answer some, some mini queens and some weapons fans. And you can take this to sword, which is the iron sword, I meant. And that's that's probably the fort, I think. And I really like it. It's a small little fort, but you know, people usually can play with it over there. There's also some chest for some of your belongings over here, so let's put it, put it in there. And yeah, guys, alright, guys. So for the whole tower to be accessed and to for it to be upgraded to the stage which in which you saw it, you actually have to complete a small quest which involves which involves you know rebuilding and finding a way to it and stuff like that. So when you when you start up the game there will be eagles pound next to the river wood, which right here. And as you can see him right here, I just took some things from him, he took the I took the key and the book from him. And you use the key to open the open tower, which progresses the whole quest. And by reading this book, Legend of the Eagle's Nest, which we will read right after it loads up, it's a little bit up. So yeah, sorry for that. Legends of the Eagle's Nest: Records of an unknown range of birds in the mountains near Riverwood and Hawkridge. There is a rumor about an old legend of a fortress high above the clouds. It said that the fort was chiseled directly out of the rock. The fort resembles an eagle's nest. That is also the reason why the fort is called that way. An old poem mentions the castle. High, high, high in the sky up there where the eagles fly there is a nest. Made of stone just waiting for a crown up there on a snowy peak the right way you have to seek. But if you discover the rocky nest, a new home you have found to rest. So the rocky slopes are too steep to scale. However, according to legend, there should be forgotten part to the eagle's nest. The global location of a castle can give this ancient map. So you can see the path right up here. And what you basically have to do is to cut through Riverwood, go up, go up right. But let me show you at this a little bit. I am not gonna record it in whole because I think it's boring. So yeah, you have to cut through Riverwood, go through that bridge. Go over here, go over there, then go up there, then they will find a secret passage, and after that you get right up there, at the and the uh, mountains. So yeah, guys, I'll see you up there to progress the quest. Hey guys, I'm up here at the eagle's nest. I found out the way to the secret passage, and now we can go on with our quest. So we have to, so we have to unlock the gate with this key right here. And then you have to strike clean, which I have no idea what it means, but you let her inside Eagle's Stone Tree. So, you can see right here that the mud is really, really nicely done. Only thing I'm gonna do is let it up a bit, just in case, you know, some of you guys just don't see it. Not sure. I see the. Uh, it's all right for me, but I'm not so sure what how it will look on YouTube. So yeah, let me put my candlelight, and after that, you just cut through this mine and go to to go right into Skyrim. <laughs> That's right. You already saw the mine. I already showed you the mine, so I'm not gonna do it again. But Stone tree discovered, that's the mine that is called. Right up there. And now what do we have to do? Is what? What the hell game? What the hell are you doing to the game? Game is still good. What the hell? Now I'm supposed to go back to the river with that spring keys. Okay, so we're here at the Riverwood tent. We're gonna spring clean. So you look you sick. You I have to find the two cake. guys that can go over here. Um, okay, here's the first one. The Aldabinur Felagi. Yes. I need some furnishing. Fine, sir. 
kein Problem. Ja, ja, I'll be German. German did it. I'll give you 7k, bruh. I'm good on price. Thank yes. you. Find a steward. Okay, so that was. That cost a lot of money. <laughs> Alright, he was the black guy, so for that hand. Also, what the hell is. Oh, that. that oh. Right here, sir, I'm sorry, but you kind of. You know, kind of blinded there. So. Wait, hey. Good to see Skyrim. You're the Still same guy I just met. Fine yes. Yes. Be my steward. And watch over the oh, thank, thank you. you. Oh, thank oh, you. Thank you. Oh, so now you'll suck my dick all night long, girl. So yeah, you are you're basically the same guy. You need oh something? my god. Okay, they are basically the same guys with different, different uh, armor. Yes. yes. Hello there, stone man. How are you doing in your stone? Looks like you're having a having a fine nice day. You'll be perfect guard for me. You look like a could use some help. Yeah. yeah. I have four, one, three, one, gold. Yeah. yeah. Good, we'll see you at Fortress. Thank you. Thank you. And now we'll craft some left stack. I'm gonna use all of my money. Hell yeah. Who I ever wanted to use some of my money. So let's find some. Ooh, you're gonna have a, you're gonna have a nice little cow. And it's gonna, it's gonna be, we're gonna have a party tonight. And this is gonna be beautiful with my cow. So, hi. Hi, OD. Mm -hmm. I want to buy livestock. If this is so, so, cow, goats, and few chickens. Let's say, for well, right? If this is so, so, okay. So I guess you don't. Next time, we build a secret passage. That's the last thing, I guess. We build it. We build it, Johanna. And the last guy we have is the crossbow. All right, you can help me rebuild the secret passage. If this, this is so. so. Yeah, sent for gold. Okay, thank you. A uh, blessing. So yeah, guys, I guess that's that's about it for the quest. So yeah, quest is really nice, short, but really it's just there for 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 that much to tick. Yeah, I done the quest because really you just find a tower and then just go to some dialog options and done. Yeah. That would be some really simple. My favorite drink. Let's 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 let's